Yo, welcome back to a brand new video. In this one, we are reviewing Marcel Halstenberg. He have just dropped this SBC. It's another UCL Man of the Match card. Another card that technically wasn't Man of the Match, but has got one. Um, so let's jump into this and see how good he is. So he's coming in at approximately 40,000 coins. He's three star, three star, six foot two, and he has just one trait which is the long shot taker. We are 100% gonna be trying these. So the best chem style is obviously a shadow. It adds plus eight acceleration, plus eight sprint speed. Then on his defending, it adds plus eight on his interceptions, a plus four on his heading accuracy, another plus four on defense awareness, plus eight on standing tackles, and then a whopping plus 15 on his slide tackles. It will make him an overall center back as a 92 rated which would be pretty goddamn insane if that was his stats card. But of course, we know they're fake stats. We'll have to prove it in game to see how he is. Let's show the team. So this is the team. We have, of course, got him next to Ramos, who is up there with one of the best centre backs in the game. So we'll be able to see the comparison to see who is as good as each other, basically. We have got Nkunku and Davies gold. We will probably sub them off at half time, just because they will be knackered and won't be up for the, the fight of the final half. We've also got Halsenberg on full chem, which will mean we'll get the best as we can out of him. Let's go into these games and see how he is. Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And what we okay. have coming up for you is actually the Champions Weird playoffs. lineup. He reads danger, he wins his aerial duels, and he organises those around him. He oh, they could finish here, Stuart! Woo, 1-0. Is he leaving? Yeah. Obviously, we didn't get to re see him at all in that game. Um, let's play the next one. Second game. Let's see what this guy's team is. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And what we have nice team. It's a very nice team. Going to be a good game. Kylian Mbappe starts with Marcus Rashford in the wide positions. And up front today, good block already. Bloody hell. Straight in there with the AI block. That was lovely. Can he put it in? Kevin De Bruyne. Oh, that's a good block. Well. Mane. And a goal! Let's go. Mane. Can they take advantage? Boom. Keen on cutting in. Money! <laughs> That's not another leave, is it? Two games in, two rage quits. Let's go on to the third one. Oh, Who have you got? I'm delighted to be able to report. I'm Derek Ray, and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And we have continuing nice coverage. What more could you ask for? Can he put it away? And a goal! You missed a tackle there. Eh? Not, not ideal if you send it back to miss your tackle. Well, one. This could square the game. Oh, but no! I'm gonna lie, that was one of the sweatiest cards for FIFA I have played in weeks. This guy is not making it easy. He's been solid so far at the back, defensively. He did cost a mistake of the goal. I did tackle and he completely missed the ball. Opportunity 
easy for them to get back into the game. Mbappe's finished. He's got so in that game, he didn't win a single tackle. That says a little bit, doesn't it? It was all right, that game, but he was the reason we conceded a couple goals. Just roamed off, didn't win the tackles. Final game. Who has he got? I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal West... Are you not team? Pass and present. Nice. Claimed by the goalkeeper. Now, what's the keeper playing at? And maybe Rashford. Yes, Halstenberg. That was a solid tackle. Pitch. Stewart, what might we see from him today? Can they take the lead here? And a goal! Paul Pogba. And oh, look at that. Challenge. That was nice. Well played. Oh, that's an interesting pass. So Solid defending. So. Wow. Defending on this game is by far my hardest part. I, I just a bit I struggle the most with. If I had a choice at the moment, he he wouldn't start in my team. Not, not a chance. He's been alright. He has he's made a few crucial tackles. But he's also once again been the man that's made the mistakes. Which is a bit shit. So yeah, we've got the second half. Hopefully we can bring it back. Let's get into it. But they took care of the situation defensively. Martial. Can he put it in? Ah. Oh. Hernandez. A glorious chance. Halstenberg. And blocked for now. Pogba. Long way out this. He definitely has a long shot trait. Wow. So he scored the long shot, which proved that he does have the long shot trait and it did go in. Although we did have four attempts at doing that. He um, had 100% tackle success rate, so he did all right. So we played four games, two rage quits, two normal. The two normal, we both lost by a lot of goals. And... Sometimes you have to blame yourself and then your defence at the same time. Defence was awful in those goals, but I'm also not the best at defending. I'm more going forward. That's where I kind of play better. Overall, in my opinion, is he worth 40,000 coins? I'd probably say yes. I'd say he's a player that you could definitely use at most ranks. If you're just starting out or you need a defender for links for the Leipzig, he's the one to use. I'd say he sent me worth 40,000 coins. So if you enjoyed today's video, hit the like button. If you have completed him and also liked him, leave a comment. If you also didn't like him, give us a reason why. And until next time, bye.